I'm Tony Piazza from uh, Metairie, Louisiana, and I've been a member of the Chain Gang since 1970. I'm a, I've been a part of them so long that uh, I feel a part of the, the, their family. It's a hard job to get on to because a lot of people would like to do it. The unique position that we're in, we there's not too many people that do this. Uh, we, we have 10 guys that come out there and there's not too many people around the country that work for NFL teams on the sideline with the chain gang. So I had a friend of mine that worked for the Saints was Silky Powell, Glennon Powell, and I all, we were good friends and I told him that in the event that uh, the Saints ever needed anybody to work the crew, I'd, I'd be glad to, to help them out. I've been a member of the chain game as a substitute since 1970 and I could not p pass up the, the opportunity to do something like this because there's a number, a limited number of people that have an opportunity to become part of a chain crew. The excitement of the game, uh, the ability to get on the field of a professional football game is just something that most people don't get to do. So I'm going to do it as long as I can. The best part of this job is seeing the talent that, that comes up from the NFL and we just get a nice inside view, very close up view of what's going on with the New Orleans Saints. We pick up everybody at CJ's house and we're on our way to the game and um, you know we, we talk, we're in the locker room changing, we go have dinner together there, uh, then we of course have the game, then after we have uh, you know, hot dogs, dessert, and we just chew the fat a little bit about the game and that's, it, there is a closeness. We understand that we are part of the game part of officiating crew and very important that we don't mess up and we concentrate on what we're doing at the time of the ball game. Game day, uh, the atmosphere is unbelievable. Uh, the game starts and the fans are so excited and they're just waiting for something good to happen. People get entrenched, they, they, come, you know, they become hardcore Saints fans. It's very emotional. The city gets a sense of pride in what the Saints do on the field. And they all are part of it. And they, they show up for the ball games, win or lose. When the Saints are winning, it, it's, it's good. Uh, you get goosebumps at times. It's very hard, but we have to keep our emotions inside of us. Uh, inside, you're jumping up and down, wanting to cheer, wanting to scream, and you can't say a word. What's really happening on the inside is your heart is pounding. Sometimes it even pounds up into your throat. I'm not sure if I'm holding my facial expressions to that, but I know sometimes there may be a really big smile on my face when the Saints have a really great play. It's fun. It's, uh, it's a part of New Orleans, a part of the state, really part of the south region of the country.